everyone here we go so after watching the video we are going to talk more about action verbs so i want you to listen carefully everyone and let's go and read what's written over here so i'm gonna give you some time so let's read it together action verb is a word that shows action well then action can you give me some examples like throw and catch well done excellent so let's move now to read what's next so i'm going to give you some time okay so let's read it together action verbs tell what have okay excellent what someone or something is doing well done excellent so action verbs tell what someone or something is doing so let me explain let me explain this okay so if i say action verbs tell what someone someone so someone so <clears throat> let's talk about teachers so my question is what do teachers do think about this what do teachers do okay Say the answer, please. Teacher or help. teachers help and teach. Teach, read, write. write. Excellent. So let's now talk about doctors. So, what do doctors do? What do doctors do? They help and they heal excellent well done so here someone or something something let me say to you for example the alarm clock the alarm clock so what does an alarm clock do it wakes you up and it helps you know what is the time so i can say also it ticks and rings it ticks and ranks excellent so you can identify the action verb in a sentence by asking what is the person or thing in the sentence doing okay everyone and please 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 don't don't forget that action verbs are words that tell you what a noun does what a noun does and remember nouns are people things animals or places so let's move now to task options you have task number one and task number two so you can choose one of them or if you want you can do two of them here task number one so um, let's read the question together Circle the action verb in each sentence. Write it on the line. So we have two instructions or two actions. The first action is to circle. And the second one is to write. So we're going to circle and write. We're going to circle and write. So let's go to uh, number one. I'm going to give you some time. Read it, please. So let's read it together. Ahmed drops the ball when we play catch. Excellent. So everyone, where's the action verb? So can you say it? Drops. Okay, this is the first one. Okay. What else? Play. This is the second one. Okay, so well done. We have two. So let's move to number two. Okay, so let's read it together. The ball rolls down the hill. 
Excellent. Here is the noun, right? Here is the noun. And usually, I'm going to tell you something. Usually, the action um, verb comes after the noun. So here is the noun, the ball. So what comes after the noun, the action verb, which is? Rolls. Well done. So here is the action verb. So let's move to number three. Rana pushes the swing high. So Rana is the noun. What does Rana do? Pushes. So here's the action verb. So let's move to number four. The swing moves back and forth. So where's the noun, everyone? Moves. No, the noun. Be careful. The noun back. is... The noun is the swing. The noun is the swing. So I said to you before that the action verb comes after the noun. So where's the noun now? Who can help? Moves. Excellent. So you're going to circle it and then you write it over here. So let's move to number five. I need your help. So let's read it together. Rashid thinks about trains. So Rashid is the noun and thinks is the action. Action verb. Well done. So we're going to circle it and write it over here. So let's move to number six. Anna learns about trains at school. So Anna is the noun and learns is, is the, the action, action verb. Well done. Excellent. So we're gonna circle learns and write it over here. Let's go to number seven. Yes. Hamad. Hamad enjoys soccer. Well done. So where's the action verb? Enjoys. Excellent. Well done. So let's move to the last one. Okay. I need your help. So well, let's read it together. He kicks the ball across the field. Well done. So where's the action verb? Kicks. Kicks. So you're going to circle it and write it over here. Well done. So let's move now to task number two. As you can see, um, there are some pictures here. So write the proper action verb under each picture, then use it in a sentence. So here, as you can see, the action verb is Yes, let's read it. Observe. Excellent. So after that, you take this or you take the action verb and put it in a sentence. So let's read the sentence over here. Ahmed observes the leaves. Excellent. So here is the action verb. So look at the picture here. So what can you say about the picture? What is the action verb or what does um, a man doing? I think. So what is he doing? He's coloring or she's coloring. Coloring or drawing and put it in a sentence, please. Let's go to the last one. Yes, what is he doing? He's praying. Well done. So you can also uh, put it in a sentence. So here are the closure. Write action verbs in the hand below. So the first one is done for you. Can you read the first one? Jump. So let's think about four more action verbs. Play. Yes. Write. Write. Read. Read. Cook. Okay, well done. So everyone finally, please, after completing your work, uh, upload the picture of it on in your class dojo portfolio. Thank you everyone and have a nice day.